Hey, hello again, everybody. Sebastian here with another Watch Our Realms video. Okay, so in this one, I am going to be summoning for an extra copy of Lust. It's never a bad idea to get an extra copy of her, especially as her events are available to us here in the global server. Now, I do think that given the problems with Apple right now, that this banner came up a little bit sooner than I think they wanted it to make it accessible to everybody, but at least they're giving us a chance to get a copy copies of a great, great hero in the game. So if uh, if you have her and you want to go for her Awaken 1, you can get different reduction on her. The one thing that I have heard in terms of an argument with her is that her first awakening is really non-essential because if you do bring somebody in like Torador or Ares, it pretty much nullifies that, right? You don't need her to be putting the defense, uh, uh, defense down on the target because you already have other members of the Nightmare Council already doing that for her. But as we get closer to third awakening, at least we get some extra speed. And eventually what we are going to shoot for, as long as we're trying to play the game, is eventually get to her five, because that's where you get the extra slashes. And uh, for those of you that may not know who she is, her lashes essentially gives us extra damage. And when she does more frequently and she hits Nightmare Council targets, she can enhance the rage a lot quicker than the Nightmare Council um, allies, then get their uh, ultimates back up quicker they do more damage this is why we like to team her up with arrogance because she just really boosts arrogance damage salazar as well that's another key figure in that so let's just go ahead and get some now one of the things i will tell you i am in fresh pity so we're just gonna run right through it the most we're probably going to get are two legendaries. I'm just hoping that I don't get anything that I'm going to dust. And if you're asking if I'm going to pity manipulate towards the Bierna Salas uh, banner, the answer is no, because I do not need copies of them. Um, whether that is unfortunate or unfortunate, it all depends on how you view it. So it's, a, it's okay. Given that this banner is available, we'll just try to get the two legendaries from this one. So let's just go ahead and get started. And hopefully uh, we're on the road to not too many greens. That's what we want to see. Let's see if we can hit some epics here. Okay, now we hit some epics. We got a copy of Estrid. All right, that's interesting. Very hard, hard unit to summon. In fact, after playing for almost 17 months in the Forerunner server, I finally got a copy of Estrid. So that's how rare she can be or how hard she is to get. All right, and now we have greed too. Wow. Well, there it is. Okay, so if we do get an, a, a copy of here, I do intend to keep going, but we'll see what we get first before we start counting the eggs in the basket. Okay, so we get a Kriya. So not surprising. This is one of the more popular heroes to to summon in the in the game. Oh, we got a twofer. It is still a two. All right. Okay, that's fine. She is phenomenal still. I like to use her for the infernal teams. She's very good if you need a lot of burns in the Arbiter of Frost. So, yes, we'll take her. So, we got two hits on that one. We somehow avoided lust in this whole thing. So, we'll let it keep rolling here. All right. And we got a copy of Hollow. All right. So, we got two there. Let us keep going here. Let me, uh, let's get these ones out of the way, too. Okay, let's go. All right, we get an epic there. And Brunor. This little guy grew on me, especially as I started, you know, developed the account. I got him to 60. I got him to fully awaken. And I still use him. In fact, I use him in the Void Rift hard, and I use him on the uh, Spectre uh, face. Um where the Selene boss is, essentially what is how people uh, refer to that stage. Because of his tensions, he has AoE damage. It's really, it's really, it's really nice to use uh, that epic, especially when you focus on the Northern team. All right, hey, here we go. All right, so can we get, can we get the copy of her already? And Boreas, okay. For my account, would this be a two? Uh, 
We'll we'll check. We'll check. Very good hero still. He's my go-to to clean things out when I need things cleaned out really quick. So there is Boreas. Uh, right. And let's keep going. Let's see if we can get Lust in. Speed run. Speed run. For those of you new to the game or don't know how to tell if you get a legendary, there are certain videos out there that will tell you. I don't want to spoil it for you if that is not something that you want to know. But given that some of us can pick that up, we can do speed runs. All right, so I saw an Abilene there. All right, oh, a lot of green. We might have to do a reset here. All right, and all right, here we go. Yep, let's put him in storage. There we go. So we are at 150. We need 100. So we're going to go through all the, all the, oh, there might be one or two here no that isn't okay so let's go to the spiritual altar is there anything in here we're getting copies of ma uh, okay one of the things that i did figure out though with ma is if you get him to a5 which i wish you the best of luck if you know, unfortunate luck if you do is that um his bp is really high so you could use him to affiliate um your demon soldiers if you wanted to all right, Boris is an esotericist. Let's look to see. Uh, there he is. Okay, so for me, that's an A3. Frozen petrification damage increases by 30%, so it just makes him even better. All right, we'll take that. Perfect. We like that. We like that, we like that, we like that. And what was the other mage that we had here? Kriya. All right, so that's it. That is it. She is fully awakened. So the problem here is we don't want any more copies of uh, Kriya. Yes, otherwise they're just going to become tokens. All right, here we go. Let's uh, go ahead and, and finish this off. So we had three chances. We had three chances to get an early copy of her. And unfortunately, uh, we hit other uh, legendaries in the game, but it's it's okay. Um, the fact that we hit already three times, we'll take that. Okay. And we'll do that one. All right. Ask me. There you go. Harpoon. All right. So it's going to be this one. And there's Brunner, and this is it, this is it. Okay, here we go. We'll just go ahead and use these, and let's get that extra copy of Lust, as the game promised. We'll be content with this, and we'll just wait for her to show up again, and eventually we'll build it up uh, to get to A5. And there it is, we got Lust. So there you go, folks. We got four legendaries in 250 nothing to complain about all right if you did go and summon on her banner to get an extra copy or get her for the first time i hope you got as many as i did wish you the best of luck especially if you're waiting towards the end maybe or if you're pretty manipulating the silas beer and the banner so i hope that you get what you want out of this event thank you all very much for tuning in and watching i will see you all next time on the next watch or runs video and do hit like and subscribe on your way out.